Hey guys. Hey guys. <laughs> so, yeah, exactly. I had no idea. It got shut down because of the copyrighted music. I didn't realize that that was a thing because I've always done my lives with the music that I own. So, I guess we're not doing Frozen Ballet. <laughs> That's okay. Um, so yeah, now I'm curious if it's gonna shut it down for any music. It didn't shut down any of the lives that I've done before, but here we are. So thanks for finding me. Uh, why don't we try one of my really old CDs? So we'll go over here to album. see what happens. We'll go ahead and start how we were about to start. Okay. All right. So no frozen music, but we'll go ahead and go anyways. So let's pick up all 10 toes and we're going to lay them down one at a time, like I was saying. So starting with your pinky toe, I like to use my fingers to help you help myself and you can do that as well. Pinky toe, second toe, really spread the toes out too. Third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. And by now your toes should be really spread away from each other. Let's peel them back up in reverse order. So big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Try to make sure you're not rolling in or out while you do this. Let's go again. Pinky toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Reverse, big toe, second toe. I already feel it in my feet. Third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Lay them down one at a time. Pinky toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. All right, let's pick all 10 toes up again, and now you're gonna put them all down at once, but I want you to really stretch them out and lay them down. So now you're... All right, guys. YouTube really doesn't like me this morning. I'm not sure what to do about it. Are you guys still there? Oh, I'm not sure what's happening this morning. Okay. Are we still live? Are we still good to go? I lost connection. The joys of live streaming. Okay, so here we go. Yes, Jess, you're still here. Colleen, you're here. Nick, thank you. Thank you, guys. Okay, I really don't know what's happening, but here we are. This is, this is fun. This is live. Okay, so we're going to roll down, but we're not just going to roll straight down, okay? So I don't want you to immediately drop because then you're just going into this um, position that we always go into. I want you to really stretch the back of your neck out. So you're trying to give yourself a double chin here. So tuck the chin back and then tuck it into the collarbones. Okay. So you're really stretching back here and then you're aiming the top of your head for your belly button. And we're trying to keep our pelvis up for as long as possible. Yeah. Hang those arms heavy. And here we're almost tucking like we say not to in ballet, but it's just so that we're stretching out right back here and then take it all the way over. We're going to do four dummy plies here. Really look at your knees. Make sure they're tracking right over your toes. Sit bones up to the ceiling. This is two. Stretch. Three. Stretch. Four. Stretch. Roll up, belly button to spine, roll it up. Imprint that vertebrae up on the wall. And we'll take the arms all the way up over the head. Now you're gonna flat back over. So now you really pull your ribs up off your pelvis, reach it out, and reach the pinky fingers to the floor. Plie, lengthen that back. Come up. Let's flip the palms away from your body, press them like you're going through something and you're going up tall through it. Arms come all the way down, 
to Brava. Feel that expansion through the front of your chest and through your back. And then you're going to rotate your legs together to first position. And I want you to feel super wide here through your chest, through your ribs, through your pelvis, and through your legs. And you can hear my baby. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get started with our plies. I know it does. This is like, this is a good, um, good practice run for the rest of this quarantine since they like can't go anywhere else now. Okay. So for plies, we'll come to first position. Arms drop out. Feel those sit bones dropping straight down. Hip points up. So you want to feel like your hip bones are connected to the bottom of your ribs. Feel all that expansion that we just created. Take a little breath. Arms through first, second, ground the bar. We're going to have two demi plies, just simple plies. Reach out, demi, arm comes down. Demi, arm through first, open up to second. Long plie through that first quarter bra, all the way down. Heels push into the ground to bring you up. We'll take a quarter bra forward, really reach out so don't sit back here, but really keep your legs where they are. Reach up and out, drop the head, flat back up, then we're going to roll through the feet. So demi plie, heels up, straighten the knees, come down, second position. Same thing in second, demi, stretch, demi, stretch, grand plie in second, Send those femur bones super wide. Come all the way up. Take it into the bar. And up. Roll through the feet. Demi plie. Heels up. Straighten the knees. And come back to first position. Same thing. Two demi plies. Grand plie all the way down. Instead of going forward, we'll go up and back. And roll through the feet. Back to second, same thing, two demi plies. Grand plie all the way down. This time we'll go away from the bar. Bring the arms to first, roll through. From second position, we're going to do four more grand plies, but if your knees don't want to do that, you can just do two demis for each grand. Grand plie, and each time I just want you to think about something different. So you can think about Expanding your ribs and putting space in between your ribs. Think about the back of the thighs pressing into someone's hands. Four grand plies. Then we'll turn the feet in. We'll take it all the way over. And we'll take eight counts here. So whatever feels good to you, you can grab opposite elbows, shake your head yes or no, walk it out into a downward dog. Just stretch. Then we'll roll it up, turn it out. Rise up in second and find our first balance in second and finish. Okay, let's try this and hope you don't get booted off. Okay. Okay guys, here we go. First position. Breath. Arms. Reach out. Demi plie. Stretch. Through first. Stretch. Grand plie. Heels press. Energy through the heels. Take it forward. Lift out of the hips. Come up. Demi plie, heels up, stretch those arches, keep the heels high. Second position, wide thighs. Feel the length. Grand plie. Take it into the bar, lift your ribcage off your pelvis. Up, roll through, demi plie, heels up. Stretch. Back to first position. Lift out of the plie. Feel those heels connected the whole time. Now here, the heels come off, but then they 
you really push to bring you up. Arm comes down, so lift back, roll through, and second. Down. Down. From the end. Let's take it away from the bar. Arms through first. Heels up. Oh, we're out of music, but we're going to keep going anyways. Grand pie. Down. Up. Grand pie. If we were doing our frozen music, we would still have music. Grand pie. And up. One more grand pie. And up. Let's turn the feet in, take it all the way over. I'm just going to count out eight counts. Just relax your neck and shoulders. The beginning of class, we don't want to carry any tension from the rest of our week, the rest of our morning into class. So really just try to let it go. All right, let's roll it up. Turn it out. Plie releve, balance in second. Feel those legs shooting out from your hips super wide. Ribs together. Arms wide. Collarbones wide. Bring the arms up. Through first. Open. And finish. All right, good work, guys. Okay. Let's go right away to the left side. Same thing. First position. Arms. Reach out. Demi. Stretch. Feel those sit bones go straight down. Grand plie. Heels press you forward. Take it over. Reach. Roll through. Second position. Slide the back down the wall. It's an imaginary wall. Grand plie. Take it into the bar. Rise up, 
expand your energy in all directions. Think of that picture. Grey's Anatomy, I'm not, that's the TV show. You know what I'm talking about. Hopefully, <laughs> maybe not. Arms up through first, open, and finish. All right, so we made it through plie without being kicked off. I wonder if the copyright thing is just because that frozen CD is so new. Okay, I'll have to do my frozen bar on Instagram. So I don't think they care about copyright on Instagram. Okay guys, moving on. We're gonna do a slow tendu. So, let's go. From first position, arms up, point of row. Tendu, front first, Front, first. Front, plie, fourth, releve, plie, and close to the side. Side, first, side, first, side, plie, second, releve, and close to the back. Back, first, back, first, back, plie. Just keep the arm here to the back, releve, and fourth, back to first. Same thing, side, first, side, first, side, plie, releve, and close. From there, we'll roll through the feet again. Find your balance with your arms, bra, ba. Keep the heels high. And then bring your arms up through the center line and finish. Yeah, so really nice and simple, just our first tendu. Two tendus, nice and slow. Tendu plie in fourth or second, releve, plie back to first. Okay, here we go. Three, arms up. Tendu front, first, front, first, front, plie, releve, plie, first. Keep your arms down. Feel 
like you're pulling up out of your ankles. Bring the arms through the center line. Pull those elbows away from your face. Lift up through the back of the neck. Um, Tondu, we're going to work on a couple positions of the body, okay? So we'll start in fifth, like we normally do. I'll tell you what, these socks are like super slippery. I'm going to change into my shoes. So, quick review of the positions of the body. We're going to work on a passe. Devant, a passe derriere, and then both of the a cartilies. So, fifth position. You have a little breath, bring the arms to a second. You're going to immediately turn away, open to the bar. So, well, I'm quasi devant to you, but I'm a passe if the mirror was in front of me. We're going to have eight tondus in fifth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to stay here and go écarté, um, écarté, devant, four tondus, one, two, three, four, three more tondus to the side, but I switch back to face my mirror on cross, one, two, three. Then I'm going to go to the back, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna stay here, go eight carte. Uh, actually, this one's Devon, the last one's right here. One, two, three, four, three more facing the side, the A. From there, I'm gonna go susu, find my balance. If you'd like, you can stay here, or you can bring it into coup de pied front, finish through susu, plie. So you're really just doing eight tondus front, seven to the side, eight to the back, seven to the side. But we're switching our body, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, to the side, one, two, three, four, switch back to face front, three. Eight to the back, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, stay here, one, two, three, four, three more, face the front. Then we do our balance. All right, here we go. arms, turn the body. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Side one, two, three, four. Three more side. Plie. Switching to the back. Two. Get the heel down. Taller through the 
left. Those lifts are really getting me. So really feel like you're picking it up, like someone's grabbing your thigh, bringing it forward. Okay, let's do the left. Start back, three leg J's. Cross in the thighs. 
We're going to go fifth position, arms, take a small balance away from your bar, so just a little balance, fondue, you're going to peek a back to right to right towards the bar, up, fondue front, carry it around. Three runs jump on the door. One, two, three, finish, back. Balance, balance, pique, right to ray, fond you back, around. Three runs jumps. One, two, three, finish, front. Then we'll go fond you front, carry side, side, carry back. Two more runs jumps, a tear. And then one on the layer, 45 degrees, all the way around. Fondue back, side, side, front, two, and off the ground. From there, we're actually going to do the wrong play in set. I know it's later in the bar, but I like to really have warm hips. Again. Then from here, we'll go circle. All the way away, forward, side, back, side. Here, we'll go susu, face diagonally towards your bar. Find your balance in susu first. Pull up the back foot to retire, and then take it to attitude back. Find your balance. We'll come back to the retire, back to the susu before we finish. Okay, so you have a small balance, say, PK towards the bar, fond your front, carry around, three run jumps, goes back. Balance, say, PK, back, three run jumps, close front. Fond you, side, side, back, two on the floor, off the floor. Fond you, side, fond you, front, two on the floor, off the floor. Then we take our two grand pieds, circular pour de bras, then we balance through retreat, through attitude, and reverse on the way back. All right, here we go. Fifth position. Arms to prepare, small balancing, balancing, peaking. Front, round, two, actually three, sorry, close back. Balance, peaking, back, around, one, two, three. We fond your front, fond your front, side, side, back, two on the floor, one, two, off the floor, off, pull it out, back, side, side, front, two on the floor, off the floor, grand plie, wide hips, heels, press, fifth, again, circle, down, Just you, Sue. Find your balance. You're going to pick up your back leg through a critique, through a retro. 
Take it to attitude. Stay up on this right hip. Pull the hip points up. You can keep balancing if you like. <laughs> technical difficulties. So I do want to try to finish this at 11. So that means we have 10 minutes. So let's do frappe and then we'll do grandma mom and center. I usually do that anyways, grandma mom and center, as long as you can kick your legs front and side. So let's go. We'll just take one set of frappes en croix. We'll do it three times. So the first time you're just on flat, frappe front, side, back, side. Double frappe if you can, front, side, back, side. Take it up to releve, and you can do singles or doubles, front, side, back, side. Pull it into su 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 de nu, other side, same thing. Frappe en croix, again with doubles, again on releve, and that's it, no balance. Here we go. This is a long intro, so just be ready for those eight counts. On your side, flex. Hold it out, 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 out. Hold. Roll it. Out, 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 out. Su su. Other side. Hold. just no music. You can stretch if you prefer. I'm just going to swing my leg in attitude. 16 counts on this side, 16 on this. So whatever you like, this is our little interlude between bar and center. Thanks, Jess. Okay, here we go. Swing, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sounds like somebody's calling my daughter. Tablet. And let's go to the other side. 
Swing. Two, three, four. Keep the belly button pressed in. Eight more. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, good. As long as we're all feeling loose and warm, let's come to the center. Let's, I won't do back because I just don't know your situation, but let's go fifth position quasi. Do this and then kick it. Fifth position quasi. You're going to have two gramamas, quasi demand. Gramama fifth, gramama fifth. Fondue, instead of stepping to it because of space, let's pull it back to ourselves, to su. Then you're going to pick up that front foot, my right foot, up to passe, switch the body to face each other, the mirror, en face, side, two more on side, side, fifth, side, fifth, fall on your side, susu to the front, pick the right foot up again, passe, switch, quasi on the left side, from my front, fifth, front, fifth, fall on your susu, pick it up, Computer. Side, fifth, side, fifth, fondue su su. Really feel that supporting leg. Pick it up and then we'll finish there. So two bramamas, fondue, pull it into su su, then really feel both legs working together. One into the floor, one spiraling up and side, up, front. Side on the other side. Okay, here we go. Ready? Front. Front. Fondue. Su su. Up. Side. Side. Fondue. Su su. Up. Other side. Front. Actually, I don't want to do an adagio. <laughs> Let's do something else. 
chat and journal. Do you want to do that one more time or are you done? Let me know. Five of you have hung with me. Thank you for that. What do you think? Maybe we should just do our reverence. Again, again, okay, let's do it again. Thanks, Colleen. <laughs> oh, you're a mess. Okay, just take it nice and slow, yeah? Here we go. Supporting leg 
when you go for the pirouette, that you push into it, right? So that, because sometimes, especially when it's slippery, like it is right now for me, when we go to turn, if I'm not really pushing, then my heel goes back before I hit the releve, and I like lose my turnout, right? So just really shoot that leg into the floor and get high up on that hip. Yes, yeah, 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 for sure. Um, but yeah, so just try pirouette. Just go from fifth. Well, and don't try pirouette if it's not safe. Yeah, <laughs> so pick it up, retrograde to four. Now, don't, don't even worry about turning, actually. Just hit the retrograde and feel that supporting leg from the fourth. It's spiraling down into the floor while it's also from the knee up, well, actually, even from the ankle, spiraling up into the hip. So you have that oppositional energy, but both of them are spiraling. One spiraling like uh, into the floor. I can't think of what that like drill bit is. And then the other one spiraling up into your hip. So don't even worry about the pirouette. Just try to feel that strength through the supporting leg. And then of course, do the left side. Up to fourth, you're gonna think this right leg is going through the floor. So as you pull your leg to retrograde, pull, 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 pull this leg down and up. I need like a marker board so I can draw it. But that's a really good thing to practice. So even if you don't feel safe doing pirouettes right now, which I know a lot of us don't, carpet, slippery floor, no space, just going to fourth, feeling this, and then just letting the turn like balance, if that makes sense. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for sticking with me through all of the technical difficulties. This is the most hot mess life I've ever done. But um, that's why we're in our pajamas. It's supposed to be come as you are. So I would love for you guys to join me on the Zoom link. If you got that in your email. I'm gonna go grab another cup of coffee, get comfy, and yeah, I'm gonna do some journaling. We can talk, I can't wait to like see you. Thank you for coming. I'll see you guys soon, okay? Bye.